Да. What's up guys? V-Duck, day seven, and holy Christmas, this is starting to get crazy. I feel like I'm constantly filming and editing, but it's all good, man. I'm gonna grind this out for you guys. 25 days of Christmas V-Duck vlog every day until then. So, as you can see outside, we got nasty weather. It's freezing cold, it's raining, we can't ride, nothing to do, hanging out around the house, so we're gonna have to figure out some stuff to get us, keep us entertained in this video. Yep, at the moment, it's just me and the boys hanging out around the house. I don't know what we're gonna get ourselves into, man. We're pent up, it's raining. We already smoked the pork butt. Um, hmm. We could cook something else, but I don't have any other meat thawed. Maybe we play some guitar. What do you guys think? Man cave tour? What do you want to see, man? What's everybody into? This is where I hang out, man. If you guys have ever seen me in, if you guys have ever seen me in EN187's live stream, <laughs> if you guys have ever seen me in EN187's live stream, this is the room that I'm hanging out in. This is the room that Jake stayed in when he came and hung at my house. And I left the LEDs on all at night so that he could have a night light. Cause I'm polite like that. <laughs> Ghostbusters! You guys want to talk camera equipment? I'm always charging batteries. I'm always getting told that the battery is dead and that the memory card is full. I'm headed in here to the kitchen. I'm about to make myself some lunch, so I thought I'd bring you along with me and show you what I'm about to do. Keto lunch going down, man. This has six grams of carbs and two grams of dietary fiber, so you subtract the fiber from the carbs, and then whatever you have left, four grams, that's not a lot. It's still keeping it super low carb. I've got some of the pulled pork here that I barbecued yesterday. I've got this low carb cauliflower and green bean mix. I've got some coconut oil, substitute for olive oil. And I've got some holy guacamole. This is gonna be my lunch today, man. I'm gonna stir fry all this up in this uh, skillet that I have going here. Let's get it popping. Hey, what's up guys? All right, so I'm gonna take a couple tablespoons of this here coconut oil, throw it in my skillet. It smells good, don't want it to burn. Turn that heat down a little bit. I've got this glass cooking service here, here at the new house. Turn that fan on, sorry for the noise. This glass cooking service here at the new house heats up so fast. And the temperature adjustments on it are so precise, I really like it. I didn't think I was gonna like it coming from a gas range, but I really do enjoy cooking on this. Oh, look out now. Now I'm just gonna stir fry this up, uh, get these uh, veggies going here, get these sauteed up until we uh, get those about halfway done. And then I'm gonna add my meat, because I don't want to cook my meat anymore. I just want to bring it up to warm temperature so that I can eat it. Smelling good. You guys see that? Cauliflower, green beans, some herbs and spices in there, it looks like. I ain't mad at it. One thing I do like to do is always clean as I go, man. Clean as I cook. Keep your cleaning area as clean as you can. Keep the little grease specks off. Keep my cutting board clean. 
All right, man, it's looking like these veggies are about halfway done now. I'm gonna go ahead and add my meat. Notice I'm not using any sauce here, man. You gotta be careful with the sauces while you're on keto. Can't be throwing any barbecue sauce in here. All that stuff has carbs and sugar. So you gotta be careful. We're going for low carb, no sugar. If you're cooking with olive oil or vegetable oil and you're looking for a healthy substitute, check out this uh, organic virgin coconut oil. We use this to cook with all the time. It tastes delicious and it works just the same as all the other shit. Starting to look pretty good over here. I'll give you guys a little look. A little look-see. Then our pulled pork, vegetable, stir-fry mix here. Not gonna be able to put any rice or noodles in there as much as I'd love to, but hey, it is what it is, man. This is gonna fill us up. We're gonna have some, uh, some nice, healthy fuel for our body. Looking and smelling really good here, guys. I don't know how well you can see that, but it is looking and smelling pretty fucking nice in there. Green beans, cauliflower, some pulled pork. Shit, man, not bad. I'm gonna go ahead and call that good, I think. Looks good to me. Now we're just gonna go right into our bowl here. A couple nice, healthy helpings. With a little cheese blend right on top, not too heavy, but you can have cheese on keto. So that won't hurt nothing. A little cheese on there, be all right. Let that melt down for a minute. Then I'm gonna take my holy guacamole, my guacamole minis, crack that bad boy open. And that right there, ladies and gentlemen, is lunch for today. Cheers, I'm gonna go enjoy this. All right, here we are, man, sitting down for a little keto lunch. Let's check it out, see how it turned out. See if it sucks. Oh my God, dude. It's so fucking good, man. Man, this is really, really good, guys. Hell yeah. Drinking Zevia as always, zeros up and down the board. This is better than I thought it was gonna be, guys. This is really good, man. It's really good. Yeah, let me get you guys set up. This is better than I thought it was gonna be, dude. I was kinda just freestyling something, you know? Try with the bite of the avocado. Boy. I ain't mad at it. If you're out there and you found this video because I put keto in the tags, and you're debating in your head whether or not you can give up carbs and sugar and shit, and whether or not the meals are still gonna taste good, I promise you, man, this is the bomb. And I'm a fat kid for life. I love food. I love dessert. I love carbs. I love pasta. I love bread. I love chips. Obviously. This stuff, man. This is good food. I know good food, man. And this is good food. You can do it. We're gonna fucking, we're gonna, we're gonna grind this out, man. I feel like we're gonna succeed. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, you know what to do. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys on tomorrow's video, man. Peace.